Welcome back to the 3D Botmaker Diecast Racing League. We are coming to you live from 3D Botmaker Studios here in Race City. It's finally time yes, it is. to kick off Season 4 of King, King of, of the, the Mountain. Mountain. I have been waiting for this. Season 4 is all about 80s cars, so you know what that means. Bring on the Fieros. Yeah, about that. I'm afraid nobody qualified a Fiero into the race. Wait, over 400 cars and nobody sent a Fiero? Only one team sent in a Fiero, and sadly it did not qualify. Wow, I'm, I'm kind of disappointed. Well, after the events of the Fiero tournament, can you blame them? Let me guess, they sent Mustangs instead. Oh, we got a lot of Mustangs. We're going to need a lot of waivers. Here's how this season will play out. We'll be having six tournaments of 64 cars, a seventh tournament of 32 cars, and the winner of each tournament will compete in a final tournament of champions to determine the season four King of the mountain. But that would only be seven champions. Yes, that will leave one more spot for the car with the fastest track time throughout the season. Oh, I see. So the season record holder will earn a spot in that tournament of champions. What if the record holder is already in the tournament of champions? Then it will go to the next fastest car that is not in the tournament of champions already. Nice, a reward for speed. Exactly. Let's get to our first group of drivers. Our first driver of the night is Perla White driving for Pooch Speed. Perla is driving in the Nissan Maxima wagon and comes to us from Mineola, Florida. Nice touch with that carbon fiber hood. Her car weighs in at 56.7 grams. Up next we have Takume Fujiwara. Wait a minute, Takume is from Haymarket, Virginia? Perhaps he moved to the United States? So you're saying he went from delivering tofu on Mount Okina to Haymarket, Virginia. I'm sure Haymarket is a beautiful place. Do they even have mountains there? I have no idea. Next up in the DHL Ford Sierra Cosworth is Cletus McYeetus. Not to be confused with Yeezus or Yeezys. I don't think anyone was confused about I'm that. I'm just clarifying. McYeetus comes to us all the way from Saarbrücken, Germany. Oh, nice. Well, bonjour. Uh, they're German, not French. Okay, my bad. Hola. It's hallo. Anyways, our last driver is Hollingsworth Worth McMillions. Wait, hold up. Is that a dog in the back seat? Uh, yeah, it is. Okay, now I'm cheering for McMillions already. And he has the windows on that Mercedes 380 SEL open, so he is a responsible pet owner. What can I say? I got a soft spot in my heart for dogs. Here we go with our first race here at Race City. They're lined up, and they're off. Perla White and Takame starting in the front row. Cletus McGeetis currently in second place. They're through the first big turn. They're really moving fast out there. Well, these cars have all been modified from different builders around the world for speed. Pearl White handling this track in that wagon very nicely. Very nice indeed. Pearl White gets a time of 15.60. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. And there we go, our first wreck. Oh yeah. At the new location. Well, they had to christen this new racing area with some chaos. What better way than with a Ford upside down? Let's see what happened there. Takume gets into the back end of Cletus McEdis' car. I like this right here. Look at McMillions. He goes in for the late hit, then he backs up slowly from the scene of the crime. Hollingsworth McMillions comes to us from Fort Walton Beach, Florida, and is driving for the Grey Poupon Driving Club. Oh, wow. So he's rich, rich. I guess so if you consider buying mustard a sign of wealth. Have you seen the prices at the grocery store lately? I don't really do the shopping. Just buying eggs is a sign of wealth. This race is brought to you by ModelCarsHouston.com. Model Cars Houston is the place to go for, well, model cars. It's in the name. They've got high detail, collector grade cars, accessories, dioramas, and figures. We use a lot of their products here on the show. Make sure you check them out, ModelCarsHouston.com. Here we go with race two. Pearl White currently in the lead with five points. Cletus McEdis has three. Takume Fujiwara, two. And Hollingsworth McMillions with one. Let's see if Takame Fujiwara still has it after all these years. He's currently in the lead in that white Toyota 8.6. Pearl White challenging for position around that corner. She gets blocked. Don't spill that cup of water, Takame. Fujiwara goes flying through the parking garage, and he will take race two with a track time of 15.5300 seconds. That puts Takame Fujiwara as the current season record holder. After two races. Yeah, I'm sure that won't stick. What happened to Hollingsworth McMillions? I think McMillions stopped over at Mickey D's for McNuggets. Someone should tell him that's not the drive-thru. You know how these rich guys are. They don't want to go through the drive-thru like us common folk. They expect the staff to come all the way out to their car and take their order. But I'm going to give Hollingsworth McMillions a pass here. Why? Because he has a dog. Plenty of people have a dog. That's no excuse. Come on, look at that dog. It's a good dog. Okay, it is a good dog. I got to give it to him. I wonder what its name is. I think it might be Forbes. That's a very fitting name. 
I wonder if he likes mustard. You should never give your dog mustard. It's toxic for them. Huh. You learn something old every day. Here we go. They're lined up for race three. Mick Millions and Mick Yedis will be starting in the front row. Cletus McGeetis driving for last row motorsports. So he's used to coming in last. Hey, it's good to have realistic expectations. Here they go, tight group into the first big corner. Mick Millions takes the lead on the exit. Cletus McGeetis in second, he's closing in on Mick Millions. I'd like to be closing in on some McNuggets right now. Cletus McGeetis trying to close that gap. Here they come to the finish, and Mick Millions takes the win with a 16.2225 second track time. Hey, what happened to Perla White? It appears Perla White may be paying a fee for the parking garage. Didn't someone tell her she doesn't have to pay if she's in the race? Well, validated parking can be confusing at times. All they have to do is show the parking attendant their waiver, but she's in a race. Well, it looks like she was having some car problems right there. Perla White up on the wall, then she pulls in, and look at that parallel parking. Impressive. I wonder if she has that automated parallel parking feature on that car. Those are pretty cool. Let's look at the standings going into the fourth and final race. Takume Fujiwara in the lead with nine points. Perla White and Cletus McGeetis tied with eight. Hollingsworth McMillions has six. Cletus McGeetis and Perla White in the front row. Let's go. These drivers are very close on the scoreboard. Really, it's anybody's race. Perla White with a slight lead here. Cletus McGeetis gets sideways. I think he spun all the way around. While he's blocking traffic, Perla White has a clear track in front of her. I think she might have this one. She's got an absolutely huge lead. This one is over and done. Perla White takes the win. Uh-oh. Whoa. We got an impact. Oh. Hey. There's some demolition derby right there. Hollingsworth McMillian's taking the brunt of that collision. I sure hope Forbes is okay. Do dogs have nine lives or is it just cats? They gotta have more than that. You're probably right. Look right here, Takame Fujiwara, unable to stop his car. And once again, Hollingsworth McMillions leaving the scene of the crime. Yeah, now that you mentioned that there's something suspicious about that guy. He's probably involved with some kind of insurance fraud. Okay, let's not throw around accusations that we have absolutely no proof of. But the winner tonight is Perla White driving for Pooch Speed in the Nissan Maxima wagon. Also, Takame Fujiwara is the current season record holder, so he's still in this thing, but I don't think 15.53 is going to be the top time for very long. I'm a little surprised to see Takume get knocked out in the qualifier round. Who knows, maybe we'll see Bunta take the track. Oh yeah, his old man really knows how to drive and make some good tofu. Thanks for joining us. Until next time, I'm 3D Botmaker. And I'm 2D. And you've been watching King, King of, of the, the Mountain. Mountain.